Happy New Year, Leo. This is a quick and general reading for the year 2024. I do offer these readings. You can find that on my website. All right, so let's take a look here, Leo. Leo, this is a year. Let's look at this. This is basically the theme and what's coming in and what's your maybe a challenge. I don't know. But you have a lot of like energies here with um, a lot of changes in many, many deci decisions. Some of you may be making some strong decisions that could be um, legally binding because I do see law. A lot of you will be dealing with uh, law and justice and manifestations. And this could be something in the future or I mean that could be something that you're not uh, you're very unfamiliar with okay and for some of you this is coming up in the future um i do feel that um there could be some important legalities happening this year so i do feel that kind of energy a lot of you are dealing with karma good or bad you know i do see that energy um there is something that's kind of confusing and a fog around that so this could be problems with attorneys problems with um justice authority so it's not the best energy. You know, it's truth and integrity would definitely be important and stay on the right side of the law. All right. Making decisions, too, are going to be very complicated. There's going to be a lot of comp uh, confusion. But this is a time to make sure that you um, check everything, you know, double check and focus. So I'm seeing that kind of energy. And there is some kind of karmic cycle here um, that's definitely showing up here. Um, I do feel that also uh, there's this is a part where you're not seeing everything, um, you know, and there's it could be some deception around you, too. So this is a time where, um, you know, lawyers could make mistakes. Um, it's it's not the easiest energy with anything with legal or justice or court. And some of you are clearing up some karma as well. So there is that energy there as well. So seeing that there. OK. You overall, I'm to, um, what I'm seeing here too, there's an important message here, and this is a base energy too, is um, things from the past. This could be siblings. This can be um, people that you've um, had communications with. What you said, the written word is very, very important. Your creativity too. Uh, you may bring back something that you've been, you know, a, a talent that you've always wanted um, that you put on the side that you or, or you haven't used or a skill. Um, communications are very strongly indicated here in uh, high creativity. For some of you, there is something that you're resisting change. You're trying, you're not, you're, you're, it's very hard to get out of your comfort zone. Um, so I do feel that energy it could be dealing with a Leo or the time of Leo is going to be very strongly indicated here. There's a stubbornness or something that you're holding on too strongly that you're going to have to let go of. Um, your health is in question here too. So it's like your health. Uh, for some of you, this could be problems with teeth problem with the oral or the head so I do feel that energy doesn't necessarily mean so like I said it's a general reading um, this is getting rid of your deepest fear some of you maybe need to relocate or relocate for a job a relocation could clear your energy but it's like you're not um, very um, fast to do that a lot of you are dealing with a lot of stress um, too and this could be some health issues um, it is important time to know that you need to keep moving forward. You have to have help around you. There are some reoccurring issues that you may have to address. And this can be something also from the past um, dealing with, um, I want to, uh, some of you, this could be dealing with the father's side of the family or children as well. So I do feel that energy creative blocks. So I am feeling that. Okay. Um, and it's taking things to a more inspired uh, level is going to be important. When I'm looking at you overall here, I do see the past is showing up uh, strongly here, okay? We are seeing here um, something is returning from the past, okay? Um, for some of you, this is dealing with father issues or, um, a, um, or parental issues. I do feel that energy. There is a little bit of negativity here, too. Um, this is being held back from the past somehow. Um, childhood issues could be purging or coming up or mother issues. I'm something with the family as well. I do feel that here um, also there is um, some lessons to learn. And to me, this is like um, maybe some things will rehash and 
Um, you're going, and it's, it needs to clear this year too. So I do feel that everything with compassion is going to be important in trying to uh, st st stave off um, negativity. All right. So it's like um, a push and pull here. It's not the easiest energy here. So it's like past karma being cleared as well. So I do feel that energy. Um, when we're looking at your home foundation, family and stability and um, that right there, your personal life, we are looking at um, a Virgo is coming into focus or it could be very strongly indicated here, the time of Virgo. Um, I do see dealing with a child. I see some kind of either maybe health issues are uh, relevant. Lifestyle changes and health um, definitely needs to be focused on making some adjustments. A new cycle is opening up. For some of you, this is a new child or a child that needs some help um, uh, around you. So I do see that energy too. Um, I do feel here that there is a, um, a good ending or something that may be that have that may have been a struggle is coming to a very good conclusion here as well. Um, you may start reopening lines of communication with family members or people that you haven't talked to in a while. So it's a slow build. So it's like a, cl a clean slate again. So I do feel that energy. But health and well-being is definitely something that is in focus here too. When we're looking at love here, we do see here. Um, Home foundation is very important, all right? There is something from the past here, um, love and compassion. There are some changes as well. I do feel some of you, um, this is a year where you will reconnect with someone from the past. This is a love interest, all right? So I do feel that. For others of you, I do feel there's going to be a separation or a divorce. It does surround you. Um, uh, be careful of a third party involvement. Love could be complicated from what I'm seeing here too. There can be, a, this could be the energy of a Libra and dealing with a Libra. Um, if you're getting in, in a new relationship, which is possible, there can be interference or this is a person who's just been freshly divorced or just had someone is what I'm picking up. All right. So I do feel that energy too. Some of you are working on um, building a stronger relationship and um, it's going to be delayed. Um, you know, it takes time to build. So I'm seeing that kind of energy here. So it's not the easiest energy um, as well, but definitely this is something that is going to solidify and some kind of interference with people that don't like your relationship are going to be leaving. So I do feel that energy too. Um, when we're looking at work and career, I do see here there's going to be some adjustments, um, but overall you're going to be able to meet deadlines. You're going to be able to get um, what you want. You're going to be making some um, strong adjustments, but this is also high creativity. Everything you want and desire is within reach here. You have that magic touch, so you should be doing well. Um, this is you in the spotlight, definitely. There is some fame or fortune. Um, for some of you, if you're like in, um, want to be in the public eye, you definitely will be. You will be um, noticed. You may connect with people in authority strongly here too that may help you. Or someone who's famous is what I'm seeing here, and it kind of, um, or you, some one of you, um, some of you are going to become famous in uh, in one way or another. Uh, there's success here with some adjustments, though. Okay, so definitely seeing that energy. Um, your financial situation, we're seeing something. This is good with um, long distance, um, overseas opportunity, relocation of jobs, or dealing with import export. But it's a slow and steady um, energy here as well. You have a wish fulfillment here. You're going to be satisfied with your um, money. So I do feel that energy too. So money should be coming in uh, pretty strongly. Aquarius is showing up here too, or the time of Aquarius is going to be uh, strongly indicated. So I do see that energy. Um, that Yes, there has been, um, if you've done put in a lot of work and uh, on, within your finances or whatever it is, money-making um, opportunities, it's going to pay off. The ones that didn't, you still have some um, obstacles here to get through, but you will get through them, okay? Because I see some kind of wish fulfillment with money and being happy, and I do pick up an Aquarius energy. So um, that's significant. Now, this is all, overall a year or two where I do feel that you may have a lack of spontaneity um, at times too and motivation. You're very goal-oriented and you plan everything to the smallest detail this year. You have a good judge of character and you're going to be understanding people more. So I do feel that energy as well. Um, the thing here I do see also 
it indicates that if you, you may find it hard to express your deepest feelings and you yearn to be very loved and desired this year too. So that energy is showing up strongly. All right, I'm going to pull some cards. All right, so the theme of the year, definitely we're seeing here is the three of diamonds. So to me, this is high creativity. This also indicates to me communications, but this is indicating legal documents. Anything that you do sign could be legal binding. So make sure that you dot all um, your I's and T's and uh, read the disclaimers and that because it could be legally binding. Um, write things so you don't forget them. So there is something there and there's going to be a lot of negotiations and settlements. Um, I do feel though there is going to be some restrictions here. All right. Um, I do feel you'll be dealing with authority as well. And um, this is you also taking your power back in these areas as well. There can be a father figure or a strong um, man in high position that is going to be very helpful this year too. Uh, being very practical. I do see organizational um, skills is very important and your ability to work hard. So an Aries is also picking up, I'm picking up here too. So definitely dealing with authority and some kind of legal, maybe um, negotiation ju and, and justice this year. So I'm seeing that energy. All right, you overall, I'm seeing here the four of diamonds. So this indicates again, money coming through, um, investing in the home. Um, I do feel there's going to be some kind of great celebration as well. So that's looking good. I do feel here... Um, a cancer energy may be present too. So this is bringing money into the home is what I'm seeing here as well and building a strong foundation. So you're very focused on your finances and stability and security this year. If you are in a living with someone and they're in a partnership, they may be bringing in some money as well. So their money situation should improve. There is more friendships coming into your life too. There is going to be some kind of a celebration with your creativity um, you may be doing community service or uh, um, uh, help um, around uh, um, like volunteer work too. So I do feel that energy. So that's coming through. All right. And now with your home foundation family, we are seeing the king of clubs in reverse. All right. So when we see that, we could be dealing with um, this is, again, I feel a Virgo or a Leo coming through for some reason. Um, also, yeah, definitely a Virgo energy I keep uh, picking up here too. There is going to be some kind of change, okay? Um, the energy is a little bit in reverse here. Like I said, um, this is trying to uh, find some kind of common ground with others around you too. Um, strength and compassion is going to be very important. There is going to be um, rewards. I feel that some of you need to be more financially independent. Uh, you will be or... If you've been helping someone out with money or you've been helped, either way, that may be cut off. Um, some of you may be going into real estate or chain, um, uh, looking to move this year. Um, you're setting yourself free from some kind of restrictions from family as well. And I do feel here there is a change of direction here with work, career. Um, and I do see financial independence, and that's very important for you too, but it takes some time. All right, when I'm looking at love here, you have the 10 of diamonds. That is beautiful. It's abundant, but something is coming to a karmic close. All right, so I do feel that for some of you, you will be getting into a relationship and finally marrying and tying the knot. This could be somebody that comes in that has a lot of money. Um, this person's financially stable. It could be a Sagittarius or Scorpio. Uh, for some of you, there could be money expenditures um, because they could be a, separ a separation or divorce. I do pick up that Libra energy as well. But I do feel here that also um, love is uh, stronger for you. This could be also going into a strong, committed relationship and partnership and financially stable in a love relationship. So definitely seeing that. Some of you are a lot more uh, career focused than you are with love, and that is where your focus is. It's like you love um, making your money, starting your business, whatever it is, but it is lucrative here. I do like that energy. It's a, it's a large sum of money, and it's abundance in your love area, okay? And um, work and career, there's going to be some changes here. All right, so we are seeing some kind of financial changes and adjustments. For some of you, this could be a windfall. Uh, sudden luck of a uh, change of fortune. For some of you, it's good. Some of you, it could be some losses. It's um, gains and losses. Some of you will be taking some risks too. Um, with work and career is what I'm feeling. 
but I do feel here too there that maybe something that you've been wanting um, in a company or um, a career change it's gonna come with a delay okay so I do feel that don't doubt yourself um, you may have some uh, career prospects or wanting to change a job and maybe not everybody's gonna be happy with what your decisions are but um, there is going to be some changes here and they're going to be positive and you have to have to faith. Um, definitely you're in the limelight and I do feel here that this can also mean that someone in a company just say passes away or quits or loses a job, you may get promoted or take that position. So I do that, feel that for some of you, okay? And your finances for the year, you have the king of diamonds. It is in reverse, but this indicates financial stability, uh, really good energy, but it does take some time, okay? Um, this is like being patient to build, um, but you're doing really well. So this is making progress with your finances, pre prepping for the future. Some of you will find money with overseas opportunities. Um, so I do see that you're expanding your finances as well. So I do see that some of you are building upon something creative, a creative endeavor that is going to be able to sell for good money. I also pick up an Aries energy here too. Your creativity could bring you money in, 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 bring you in money as well, but you definitely have expansion and growth. And the first stage is something that is going to be very lucrative. So I do feel that energy as well. Um, so um, that looks good, I have to say. Um, I'm looking overall, there is going to be extreme sudden changes for you. All right. Get the rest that you need. Watch the health and well-being too. Um, sometimes re-evaluating things is better than making quick decisions is what I'm picking up here as well. Um, I do feel here there is a strong energy of uh, purging and healing. And you're also combined like um, shared resources. They're coming into some kind of um, division or end. Um, there could be ups and downs and gains that I'm seeing this year too. And I do feel uh, money that you're waiting for, or if you have a tax issue or something, it's going to take some time to resolve. Um, and I do feel there's a purging with relationship and watching, uh, you know, with authority figures too. So I do see that some of you will be going into strong, committed relationships. Some of you are going to be ending it finally and moving forward. All right. So I do feel that energy as well. Um, don't resist change is what I'm feeling some significant numbers that may come into play for you this year is 3, 9, uh, 4, and I want to say 33, and 333, 333 actually. All right, well, Happy New Year. I hope you have a wonderful New Year, and bye for now.